My name is Connor. I attend the welding inspection program at FVCC and I'm here to tell you more about the program. We are one of the only ones in Northwest to hold a NDT inspection program at FVCC. There are a huge shortage of welders throughout the nation hundreds of thousands and soon to be more with majority of them getting ready to retire if not already retired there is great opportunity and pay in both fields and we will be covering more in depth of the opportunity and pay pros of the program there are multiple pros, but I'm going to narrow it down just to two that I think are the most important, and that is the equipment that school has for the students to work with is top of the line, and the instructors are phenomenal. They are genuinely there for each and individual student to help them reach their goals and succeed to their best that they can. To go over the program details, it's a two-year associate's degree school and you have your basic math, writing, and communication class. Then you move on to your basic welding fundamentals and safety for both and then you go into your welding classes. You have the opportunity to test and receive a certification in all processes of welding when it comes to stick welding, MIG welding, TIG welding, and flex core welding. And they both programs you have to take a fabrication class and you have the option to build whatever you may feel. It could be a coffee table all the way up to a flatbed for your truck if you're trying to get a head start on the work that you're getting into. You are required to draft a blueprint for that fabrication class before you build and it has to be approved by the instructor. When it comes to fabrication, their second year they go on to an advanced fabrication class and I don't know a whole lot to it because I, I ended up going the inspection route but I do know they go into fabricating pressure vessels and they have to meet the requirements of that pressure vessel. For inspection, I can tell you a whole lot more. This is my last semester and I'm graduating and I've gone through the whole inspection program. You take your liquid penetrant, your mag particle, electromagnetic, ultrasonic, and radiographic testing classes and at the end, you test under ASNT with an 80% or higher to receive your certification and completion of your formal training in those testing methods. Then you can move on to your on-the-job training in those testing methods. There are plenty of other testing methods out there. Those are just the most common ones and those are the ones that our school holds. When it comes to wages, the wages differ from being a welder fabricator and a welding inspector. I'm not going to get in too much detail because it really fluctuates depending on what company you work for and where you're at and what have you.
but what I do know is with inspection right out the chute, you will have a higher wage than a fabricator. And that all boils down to the responsibilities that inspector holds. They, they have the say on whether it goes or it doesn't go. And they are constantly communicating with the upper management, the engineers, everybody on that job site to make sure everything is going smoothly. They're not there to make that company money. They're there to make that company ensure good quality work. The seriousness in both are are very nothing to mess around with. The as far as a welder fabricator, they I know on some job sites you only are afforded three strikes, three mess ups on a weld and you get fired. So their responsibility to make sure that they can produce a good sound weld with no imperfections constantly are on high. The seriousness as inspection goes is quite frankly higher than that. If they accept a bad weld that a welder has produced and years down the road that weld breaks and somebody somewhere gets injured by that you will find yourself in court so both of them have a pretty high responsibility that they hold and it's a very serious job but it is it is a very exciting field to get into with the the opportunities you have to experience the world and travel and the pay it all comes down to your preference. The To summarize it all, it's a two-year program to receive your associate's degree and you're out in the field working. Great opportunity. You can go anywhere you want with it. You don't have to work for somebody Having that knowledge, you can start up your own business. You can virtually do anything your heart desires with this knowledge that you obtain at FECC going through this program. If interested, you can give Will Richards an email at wrichardsrch. A R D S at F E C C dot E D U and get a hold of him and he is amazing. He will help you every step of the way to accomplish what you want to get out of the program. For more detail, you can follow Flathead Welding on Instagram to see a little insight of what the students go through when it comes to welding, inspection, and what have you. I want to thank you all for allowing me to have this opportunity to tell you about the amazing program Flathead Valley Community College has for welding fabrication and inspection. Thank you.